All right, guys, we are in for a treat. We are getting schooled in barbecue by one of the best barbecue season right around the corner. And the master is here, uh, Stephen Reichland. Stephen Reichland, barbecue hall of famer, TV star, New York Times best-selling author. The list goes on and on. His latest wow. cookbook is called The, the Brisket Chronicles. The accolades Chronicles. just keep coming. No I wonder mean, I'm so tired. They <laughs> love you. This is great. Okay, the Brisket, brisket Chronicles. Chronicles is your new book dedicated strictly to brisket. Brisket 24-7, brisket all over the the world, brisket for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and there are even brisket chocolate chip cookies for dessert. Oh, I love yeah. that! I Listen, no one in to this town that. would complain, that's for sure. No, they're really good. Anyway, I want to show you something maybe you haven't seen, okay, okay which is a brisket steak. Now, okay. tradition holds that brisket is cooked low and slow, takes right. forever. Anyway, I do have a cooked brisket here, so that was the little shortcut, but I'm going to show you how to turn it into a steak. Ooh. So the first thing we're going to do is yeah. make a shallot and sage butter. So oh, I'll add. Oh, all right. So you just got some butter in there already melted. Okay. And chopped fresh sage. Beautiful. All right. And you just and we're simply that going in to simmer those ingredients together. Okay. And then the next step, uh, I have heated a grill pan. Now, of course, this will be outdoors with a real grill because. You mean you don't normally work on an electric grill? We're the real deal here. <laughs> and we're going to place those brisket steaks right in the skillet. Can we talk about how to get these? Because I know finding brisket is a trick within itself. It finding is. a good cut of brisket, well, that's really tough. So we've got Porter Road Butcher here. Yes. They're amazing. And I'm so glad because, you know, on my Project Fire TV show, the newest TV show, mm -hmm. they actually supplied the pork secreto for the ah. show. This is a very rare cut of pork. Oh, and, nice. And uh, they sent it in for us. So, you know what? Hey, guys, I, if you're listening. We love uh, that. And oh, look at that. They are. They're on, they're on our show fairly often. Porter Road Butcher is really incredible. We love this, And that's guys. one of the secrets to getting brisket right, right? Getting a good cut. Well, getting well, anything right. right. I mean, you know, remember where your food comes from, how it's raised matters as much as how you smoke it. Okay? And you, and you, you truly believe you that. You really good get know. good. Now, what I want to do with these brisket steaks is we'll simply baste them as they cook Ooh. with our shallot, That's sage butter. Be nice. Okay? Yeah. This is a great dish to do with leftover brisket, by the way. Oh, okay. nice. And then we'll give each one. Uh, just a good sear. turn it oh, over here and you can line. see you get some beautiful grill marks beautiful. coming up. So yeah. you could think of this as brisket resurrected. <laughs> <laughs> you gave it a second life. Yes. Point I gotta say one of the things I love about your cookbooks is sort of, I'll call it your special magic, whether it's the way to do a rub properly or the extra butter or just the layers of flavor that you add to the barbecue, it just elevates it. Well, thank you so much. And, you know, what fascinated me about the Brisket Chronicles, so I've been doing barbecue for 20 years, but this book not only takes you outdoors for smoking and grilling, it also takes you indoors. Braised brisket, stewed uh. brisket, brisket soups. Uh, brisket breakfast. I think it's incredibly versatile. I mean, I can't tell you how many times I've, I've actually had to think sometimes, what is corned beef? Corned beef brisket. Corned beef is brisket. brisket. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Montreal smoked meat. Brisket. Vietnamese pho. Brisket, right? What? The soup. I didn't know that. That's the meat that they simmer to make the stock. I didn't it's know It's brisket. That. It's Italian funny. bolito misto. A Cuban mm -hmm. vaca frita, which means fried cow. Uh, Spanish, Caribbean, ropa vieja, old clothes. It all starts with brisket. All Gosh, brisket. This so looks I know incredible. they don't feed you very well here, <laughs> but, um, <laughs> but uh, maybe, you know, what we'll do here, let's see, we'll do Slice that. that well, up. you've that done it for us today. Turn yeah. that off. And then I just want to show you, to finish this up, yes, I'm just doing freshly it. grated horseradish, okay? <gasps> oh, because what? you know what they say is brisket without horseradish is punishment enough. Oh <laughs> my gosh. <laughs> now, that. I have never had it like this. This yeah. is a whole different level. Guys, Stephen has a fun event that's happening tonight. He's doing a tasting, a talk, and a book signing all at National Public Television. It starts at 6.30. You can get your tickets at eventbrite.com. Oh, goodness. Go check yes. it out. Ask him all the questions. He is prepared all for the your things. answers. Here, listen, there's a lot of people who know how to do things. There's very few people who know how to teach. You are one of the best. Thank you. Ever yes. when it comes By the way, to barbecue. I have to tell you, I'm having so much fun in Nashville. <laughs> I landed uh, about 11 o'clock last night. I hit three clubs last night. Didn't get yes. to bed till 2 in the morning. Yes! I'm yes. planning my restaurants, my 
my entertainment tonight. He's it's written quite a two great country town. songs since he's been in our studio. <laughs> I'm excited, man. That's delicious. Oh, my so gosh. Good. That is a good time. Yeah. You guys, go see him tonight at Nashville Public Television. Buy the book, Brisket Chronicles. Yes. I know I've given your books to friends in the past as gifts. Thank You're the you. king. And watch Thank the you. show so as much. well, everybody.